And the Portland Police Bureau tells COIN6 their new focused intervention team will hit the streets in eight days. It's designed to stop shootings like the controversial gun violence reduction team that was disbanded a year and a half ago. Tonight, our Liz Birch is going to be on the headlines to find out what the FIT team is doing to combat historic gun violence and killings. This is a new mannequin I have. I want you to all come up and, and definitely get some reps on this one. Right now, the focused intervention team is busy training. We got a first-hand look at one of their first classes, learning how to treat someone who's just been shot. The number one thing this team will be doing will be responding to shootings in progress. Sergeant Kenneth Dulio, who's leading the team, explains they'll have a tough job. I absolutely think the FIT team will make a difference, but one of my concerns with not only the community, the media, um, our elected officials, is we kind of have to make sure that expectations are not beyond capabilities. Like, we just went through 18 months of the worst gun violence the city has ever seen. We've never had this many homicides. And not even two weeks into the new year, police tell me today there have been three homicides so far, all from guns. I asked Sergeant Julio, who's leading the team, how the members are feeling now. Initially, nobody, nobody put in. Nobody wanted to do this job. Like, are we supported? It's super dangerous physically. It's dangerous politically, it's, it's, it's dangerous, you know, career-wise. Um, you know, we're going to have the support and the backing. He says they're starting to feel the support of elected officials, including the mayor. On Eye on Northwest Politics, Ken Body asked the mayor how the team will be different than GVRT. So what's different about the focused intervention team is we have a community oversight group that's been impaneled now for the last six months. They work alongside the leadership the Portland Police Bureau around hiring, around retention, around policy. As for the recruits themselves, Sergeant Julio tells me the diverse group has one common goal. These are, are incredible, passionate, caring people. And really it came down to they just, they just can't stand, you know, standing by and not being involved in the Bureau's effort to reduce gun violence. In Portland, Liz Birch, COIN6 News.